Zion City Root is, is a place of destiny. You want to do something for the Lord? I would really advise you to be here. We learn so many new things. More revelation and update our knowledge about drama. And Refresher's class is a very wonderful class. Daddy Mike is our main lecturer. This year, Refresher class is a very powerful one. Daddy divided the group into four. So in the group, we have to stage a drama and then shoot a movie. And you'll be challenged. Because you, see, you, you are going to see new things, innovative things that will keep you to think of doing something for God. in the midst of his people. Some say it's awesome. Yeah, some say it's beautiful. Mm -hmm. But the Holy Ghost breakfast is where to be. The time to come in with God. I mean, just feel God's presence. Ministry is we don't set our priority. We do we have compassion on whom that you have compassion. Let the blood of Jesus Christ. From the earliest of movies to the very latest ones. The 
Mount Zion movies are full of deep spiritual realities, strong social issues, heart-touching moral lessons, highly inspiring messages that set the captives free from diverse bondages, award-winning films like Enemy of My Soul, Ultimate Power, The Wounded Heart, Captives of the Mighty, Blood on the Altar, Haunting Shadows, and more than 35 other titles are available from the Mount Zion Media Connections. All from the Mount Zion Films Productions. It is not good that a man should be alone. I will make an help meet for him. Ngozi, I fasted for three days and three nights. Marathon. Just because I wanted a confirmation. And after, I feel led in my spirit to ask you this very sensitive question. Ngozi, will you marry me? So I'm not going to go mess up yourself, oh. Because if you ask her like that, na captain know you go, na captain know you go get. Uh, no, this is better. Okay, let's do this. beautiful on a normal day, but today is an exception. Are you serious? In fact, let me tell you something, Gazi. Your beauty is more beautiful than beauty itself. What, what, what am I saying? What, what, what am I saying? What is wrong with me? Shola, please stop it. Don't flatter me. <laughs> please.
Ngazi, you look really beautiful today. Thank you. You look smart too. Ah, I know. <laughs> I really appreciate it though. Thank you. What do we have here? Oh, I love cakes. I, I love know cakes. You do. I know you do. Uh. Shola. Yes, Nkazi. I need time. Well, you have time. Four months. But I'm not convinced. But I'm convinced. You know, after the fast and prayer I told you about, the Lord revealed something to me in uh, Ecclesiastes chapter 9, verse 7. I want you to read it. I read this morning and I was, I was, I was touched. Okay, yeah. Eat your food with gladness. Okay. And drink your wine with a joyful heart. All right. For it is now. Oh, oh, hold on. Say it again, please. Say it again. Now. Now. Ngozi, now. Not tomorrow. Not next tomorrow. Present tense. Now. You see, I think God is saying something here. For it is now okay. that the Lord favors what you do. Okay. Should I continue? No, please read verse 8. Enjoy life with your wife, whom you love. My God. All the days of your meaningless life. Oh, 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 it's okay, hold on. That's okay. The former part is what I need. It's okay. Shola. Yes, Ngazi. I need to hear God myself. <sighs> Please, be patient with me. After four months, I'm go okay. It's okay. It's okay. No problem. Hungry as I may be, I can't eat your cake. Mm. Hmm. Uh, uh. The cake. We can. Waiter. Sir, can you get us a knife? So that I can scrape this off this cake. Sir? We need, we need to scrape this off. Okay, sir. At least you should you should drink something. Drink something. <laughs> What's the problem? <laughs> You're already scared, right? Don't worry, it's gonna work. It's gonna work. I work on it. I'm not going to do it. It's not going to work that way. What's the fill gauge in the tank? You know, I bought fill this morning. What's the gauge, Shola? The fill gauge is always on empty because the fill gauge is not working. Then how do you know the level of fuel in your tank? I am very discerning, Ngozi. Uh. This is what will happen, okay? We're gonna get a cab there. Then uh, I'll get a mechanic to fix the car. No. This car will work today. Where are you going? Watch me. Oh yeah. Open the bonnet. The bonnet latch is not working. I can only open it from there. What in this car works?
What do you know about fixing the car? Start the car. See, Ngozi, because you say every mechanic is in something, doesn't mean every car problem requires it. Can we get a cab now? One more thing. What? Let's push. Push what? Your car. And guys, look, this is not happening. We're going to go out there, we're going to get a cab. Then the I'm going to get a mechanic, we fix the cab, it's fine now. Come on, Shola, let's do this. <gasps> Ooh. Come on! Look, that's why I'm still single at this my old age. I must tell you, the truth is, marriage sucks. You know, my wife made me explore other options. So, is that why you cheated on her? Oh, that is you. Mm, you see, <laughs> Jessica and I were in the hotel room, as usual anyway, and um, I had a knock. I thought it was room service, Afre. When I got there, it was my wife smiling at me. <laughs> Your wife was smiling at you. She was there smiling at me. In fact, I wanted the ground to open up and swallow me there immediately. She didn't slap you. No. She didn't hit you. No. So what did she do? Stop asking stupid questions. See, we have settled issues. And we are both good. <laughs> so did she say she has forgiven you? See, we had a good time. Very beautiful time together. Did she say it with her mouth that she has forgiven you? But she has. Wait, did she say so? Okay, she smiled at me. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> Why are you smiling? I hey, see, I don't like this awkward smile, Afraid. You scare me. <laughs> Look, trust me. You are scared of the wrong smile. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Yeah, yeah, you've been calling me. No, it's not possible. It cannot be my house. It's not possible. We'll see. We'll see. It's my house. It's your house. It's my house. It's my house. We'll see. Oh, my God. <laughs> Yesterday was real drama with Wilson. I was shocked. That woman is crazy. That woman is crazy. She's crazy. But you know what? I want Wilson. I told him. You know, he thought he could bribe his wife and get away with it. You see, that is what happens. You are promiscuous. <laughs> you set your house on fire now. <laughs> 
Hey, Wilson. Wilson. <laughs> Alpha now. I'm so sorry, man. I'm so sorry. So, guy, how did it go? Uh, we have both settled for a divorce. My God. A divorce? Hi, Wilson. Hey, Sophia. Hey, Sophia. Wilson, um, I heard what happened to your house. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Just unfortunate. If you need help on anything, I'm here. That's so nice of you. Thank you so much. I appreciate okay. it. Okay. Bye. Don't be fooled. Obviously, she didn't come here because of me. Not at all. It's just so obvious. She came here because of Shola. Uh-uh. Bro, 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 Shola will not see anything. He's clouded with in Gossip's case. Very rude thing. She couldn't even greet. I noticed that whenever we are with Shola, she's always coming here for one thing or the other. Stop it, guys. You know that's not true. I, I, we all know she's simply sen sending a subtle message to you. What? You are, you, you are so clouded with the um, Ngozi thing. Anyways, why do you even love this Ngozi girl? Ah. <laughs> Guys, you see, Ngozi encapsulates everything I need in a woman. Mm. You, know, you know the best part? She has the fear of God. She's the, she, and she's the perfect will of God for my life. Look, 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 look. Let me tell you something. We are all Christians here. In fact, we are not just churchgoers. We hold vital positions in our various churches. Uh, be? Exactly. For me, I am the chief usher in my church. Yeah. <laughs> and Wilson here, a divorcee. Of course. <laughs> what? What's the meaning of that? <laughs> look, 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 look. We are only helping you count the cost before you build. You see, Sometimes we know that you are too spiritual to do all that. But, ah, do you know her condition? What condition? Ah, she's sick now. She's not sick, she's just epileptic. Ah, she's worse than sickness. Ah, see, Shola, why do you want to carry this burden on yourself? Love. Love? Yes, love. You see, that's what you people don't understand. And I'm going to teach you what love means. Jesus Christ came, right? He carried our sicknesses, he made us his bride. That is love. The God kind of love. Something people don't have. I am ready to fight this war with Ngozi and we will overcome. I'm telling you. Well said. Ngozi, you can put me on hold forever, but it doesn't change the conviction that I have for you. I hope you know that. Shola. Yes, Ngozi. Truthfully, I have gotten an answer to your proposal. You have? I'm just being very careful because I am not desperate to get married. I love you so much. That is why I don't want you to carry my burden. You deserve someone who won't bring you shame. Ah, Ngozi, stop this now. Stop this. Ah. Come on. God has assured me that this problem is not permanent. It is temporary. We will overcome, Ngozi. We will overcome. I want to be part of your success story. I want to be part of your, of your, of your, of your life. Ngozi, marry me. Marry me. Wait, ah, ah, ah. Is that a yes I'm seeing there? Ngozi, at this point, I need to hear your voice. I need to hear your voice.
Welcome to my house. Wow. Who are these? Who are these hoodlums? <laughs> they are my siblings. <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I didn't know. I didn't know. I didn't know. <laughs> Young man, are you not going to eat? Yeah, yes, I, yes, I'm going to eat, sir. I will, sir. Mm. So you plan to marry my daughter? Yes, sir. Very good. When? We are... Any, anytime soon, sir. Very good. We are going to get a photo of the photo. Papa, we are going to get a photo of the photo. We are going to get a photo of the photo. We are going to get a photo of the photo. We are going to get a photo of the photo. Oh, Papa. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, thank you, Daddy. I love photo albums. <laughs> of different bride prizes from my family and my extended relatives. I thought you would find it interesting. Okay, sir. No, it's, 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 actually, it's, actually, it's actually interesting. It's very good. Study it very well. To show yourself approved. So that when your time comes, you don't say I'm cheating you. My son, I can see that you're enjoying our family pictures. Ah, mommy, you made the bride um. Hey! He's enjoying it. Are you not enjoying it? Yes, yeah, I'm enjoying I'm enjoying it, sir. Very good. Bikonu Ezibote Dim. Wiki, 
You mm -hmm. mad, sir? Are you not enjoying our discussion? Yes, yes, I am, sir. Very good. Bam, 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 bam. A quaggy. Okay, ring, ring, ring. My son, I prepared apple and a very delicious bitter leaf soup for you. Come and eat, my son. Yes, sir. Can I, can I, can I eat the bitter soup? Bitter leaf soup, sir? You can go ahead. But we shall have time to study the pictures and the prizes together later. Okay, sir. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ngozi! Oh, yeah, you look at the tree, you know? You can't just sit down. <laughs> Don't worry about those pictures I showed to you the other time. See, I've discovered you're a God fearing man. Uh, thank you, sir. And that is most important of all. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Please, take good care of our daughter. I will. God will help me. God will help me. She's very precious to us. Uh, no problem. I'll, God will help me, sir. God will just help me. <laughs> Thank you so much. So, God will prosper your business. Amen. Amen, sir. The Lord will be with you. Amen. I'm expecting to see you very soon. Ah, I'll come. I'll come back. I'll come back special to pay your business. I'll come back special to May God bless you. Amen, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank May you. God establish yeah. your marriage. Amen. 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 Papa. Amen. 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 We are not married yet. Ha! Huh? Can you hear me? What are you doing? Hey! Hey! Amen. Amen! about figures of speech. Can we say that for a minute? Figures of speech. Figures of speech. There are several types of figures of speech, okay? But for your class, we'll be talking about just five. Is that okay? Yes. So the first one I'm going to be talking about is simile. Say that together. Simile. 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 And the second one is second one. D. The second one, metaphor. Can see. Metaphor. Can we say that together? Yeah. Sandra. Thank 
Sandra. How are you, Auntie? I'm fine, dear. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Sandra, please wait outside. I can't see. is our refuge and strength, an ever-present help in trouble. Therefore, we will not fear. I understand what you are passing through. If God led you into this relationship, He will see you through. You told me some time ago how convinced and sure you are. Do you expect all things to be rosy and easy? No questions to move your conviction. No challenges. No storms to shake your faith. <laughs> Just like in the movies. And they lived happily ever after. Right? I don't know, sir. Shola, Satan will fight every union that has a destiny to fulfill. Don't give up, son. I am tired. Tired? I'm fed up. Fed up? It's not easy, sir. For a weak man. It is not easy for a weak man. Hmm. Shola, how can you be tired of a journey you've not even started? But she makes me tired. She suffers constantly from this epileptic seizure. At times she loses consciousness and it can be very embarrassing. I can't take it anymore, sir. I'm afraid. Of what? Of starting this journey with her. Look, Shola. If you have nowhere going, or your faith cannot carry you in this marriage, I will advise you to opt out. But, if Ungozi is a gift given to you by God, and you reject her, you may never find another gift like her again. Sir, if you were in my shoes, what would you do? I cannot be in your shoes. But what if, sir? I am a married man, Shola. Married for 20 years. People rejected it. Common sense rejected it. Why? Because she was a sickler. But I stood because I heard from God. I chose to focus on Jesus. And that is why I'm still walking on the storm. But you chose to focus on your storm. And like Peter, you are sinking. Whose voice are you paying attention to? The voice of God or the voice of your friends? Redirect your focus back to Jesus before you begin to sink. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Good, 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 good
Oh, good, 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 good. I can take that. I love this. Smile. Look at the camera. Smile, smile, smile. Nice one. All right, good, good, good. It is well. It is well. Are you, are you okay? <laughs> All right, great. So, any other person? Uh, I'm ready. All right, I'm ready. Shala, please come. Who Join us, please. Why are you doing like this? What is wrong with me, Shola? Shola, what is wrong with me? Oh, thank you for the good birthday gift you've given to my daughter. She will not forget it in a long time. That little girl has experienced so much. She has experienced the agony of living with separated parents. She has experienced the horrible sight of a bond home, Shola. Now that I've just decided with my ex, to do something right for the very first time of our lives. You and your girlfriend. You have made her experience an ugly drama of an epileptic lady. But you know this is not God's fault. You know it's not her fault. Oh, oh no, it's my fault. No, Shola, it's my fault, I take it. I told you not to bring her here. I begged you, Shola, I begged you. This was meant to be spices to my broken home. But you and your sick girlfriend, you ruined it all. She's not sick. She's sick. She's not sick. Shola, she's sick. And you are sick for not thinking that she's sick. Hey, I pity you. Shola, I pity your unborn children. Now, out of my house. Wait a second. Shola, out of my house. Before you infect us all with your epilepsy. You're making them big. Stop it. You're making them. No, no. There's nothing I can do about it. Listen, our case is so critical and our seizure is so constant. She's not having those students. Huh? They are lagging behind. Oh. If Ingosi was your daughter, will you retrench her because of our medical challenges? May I remind you that our challenge is drawing us back? And may I remind you, sir, that retrenching now, we must move us on. I mean, we have a lady here. She has contributed immensely to the development and growth of this school. Don't discard all our achievements because of this idiot's epilepsy. Okay, okay, okay. What exactly do you want from me? Thank you. I just want you to give her time. Just give her time. How long? This year, please. Hmm. I've made up my mind, so you can excuse me. What? It's not principal. I mean, this is not fair.
hello Shola. I've been trying your life for some days now, but you've refused to pick my calls. Shola, I need you now more than ever before. I need us to fight together. I need us to pray together. Even if you refuse to pick my calls, I'll still talk to the phone, believing that somehow you will hear me. Shola. 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 Wow. So why are you ignoring that call? Uh, I know the caller. Who? It's... It's no one important. Uh, so Shela, why am I here? Sophia, can't we have a little chat as friends? Look, I'm busy. I have stuff doing in the office. Hmm? Sophie, Sophie, Sophia. What? Can I take you out? No. Nope. I'm a busy woman. I don't have time for fun. But we can create time for fun. Excuse me. Don't turn me into a creator. I'm sorry. Sophie, Sophie, Sophia. Sandra, is it true? I'm afraid it is. Don't worry, in the nearest future, I'll see a Sandra the doctor standing right in front of me, okay? Take good care of yourself. Shola, you remember this place? Yeah. This was where I said yes, seven months ago. Ngazi, <laughs> what am I doing here? Where were you when I needed you most? What are you talking about? A lot happened to me last week, and you left me. I tried your line severally, but you didn't pick it. I then called with another number and you picked it. Why, Shola? Mm, but I told you I was busy. Busy doing what? Were you that busy you couldn't spare some minutes to pray with me? I'm sorry. Okay, Shola, you're forgiving. So can we pray now? Because I can't do this anymore. What? I want us to move on. Move on. To where? What I'm trying to say is that, look, we'll be friends. But, but, I can't go on with this relationship, Ngozi. No, Shola. Why? I, I can't cope. Uh, Shola. You told me of how convinced you were. You said you wanted to fight this battle with me. You said we will win together. Shola, are you no longer convinced? What happened to your conviction? I'm, 
I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. Shola. I don't know what the future holds for me. But I know who holds my future. And I'm holding on to him. I'm holding on to him. I'm holding on to him. I'm sorry. Shola! Why are you always falling sick? Why? Why? Your sickness is becoming a reproach to me. It was becoming an embarrassment to me. That was why I quit. That was why I quit. If you constantly break down like this before marriage, then what because of my future? What becomes of our children? Every time you keep breaking down, you keep, you keep, you keep breaking down. Okay, fine. I said I was going to stand by you. I said I was going to defend you, but I, I can't cope. I can't cope. How is that my fault? I can't cope. Hey, what's up, Sophia? How are you doing? Who are you talking with? Uh, uh, let, let, let me get back to you, okay? Let me get back to you. Who are you talking I with? Was, I was talking to a friend on the phone. No, you were not. I was. Shola, you were not on the phone. Sophia, I was, but you did not notice. Ah, but you just picked up that phone. You can argue with me all day, but I know what I know. And you can lie to me all day, but I saw what I saw. So what's up with you now? How are you doing? So who have you been lamenting about? Your girlfriend? Girlfriend? <laughs> Sophia, I am searching and I'm single. Are you sure? Yeah. And I don't mind the send if you can send your side, I will apply. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so can I take you out sometime? In this your car. What is wrong with my car? There is nothing wrong with the car. Shola, I saw you were struggling to start the car. Look, this is becoming frequent. Why did you just take this car to the mechanic's shop? People just think there's something wrong. The car is fine. I'm, I'm telling you, the car is all right. So, start the car. Let me see. <laughs> the car is fine, Sophia. Shola, me. start the car. Sophia, I said the car is... The car is... Eh, start the car now, if it's fine. But, 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 I started... I started this car in the morning. It was... It was... It was... Shola, start the car. You see, Sophia, let me tell you something. I prefer to take transport or walk on the road than drive a 40 ride. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's okay. I just wanted to help. All right, thanks. Take care of you. See you tomorrow. Take care. 
thank you. Shola, you need to park this car aside, please. I know, please. I know. Uh, please, Sophia, I don't know. Can we push the car together? Me push your... Are you high? Hello. Hello, baby. Shola, why are you calling me at such an ungodly hour? And with that, your ugly bedroom voice. Ah, uh, ah, uh, Sophia, be nice now. What's, what's wrong with you? How may I help you, sir? You know, baby, I was, I've, been, I've been thinking about you all day all night and, and I just want you to know that you are so beautiful really okay now I know are we done nope look if you don't have anything reasonable to say Shola then good night Mr. Shola all right good night oh, hold on hold on hold on, hold on. what can I take you out tomorrow? All right, Shola. So where are you planning to take me? Sophia. You see, for a long time I've been searching for the bone of my bone and the flesh of my flesh. And ever since I set my eyes on you, I knew there was a divine chemistry somewhere. But I just found it difficult to understand this chemistry until recently, when the good Lord revealed something about you to me. But Shola, why all this? For God's sake, we are colleagues at work and we see every day. Why the sudden interest in me? Ah, oh my God, Sophia. I'm going to tell you something now, and I'm going to be very straight. I apologize. Mm hmm Sophia, I want you to, I just, how do I say this? How do I marry me? <laughs> so that was so straight. Ah, oh, I apologized ahead. Sophia, I've been blind. I've been blind, I have been blind, but now I see. Yesterday, the Lord gave me a revelation about you. I saw you, you were wearing a white gown, and I was wearing a suit, uh, a, a, a black suit. You held my hands, and you took me to a car, a black car. Sophia, you were driving the car, and I was sitting beside you. Before us was a river, and as you were driving, you drove right into the river. <laughs> and what was that supposed to mean? Ah, uh, Sophia, the river signifies abundance. 
Now, we are in the vehicle of marriage, driving into abundance. Sophia, marry me. Marry you? Ah, Sophia, yes. Marry me. You know, it's okay, it's okay. I, I, I understand. I know you, you were shocked. You didn't expect it. It's okay. I will give you time to study me well, okay? Think about it. Pray about it. And if possible, fast about it. Because God is... Okay. Mm. I'll marry you, Shola. Are you joking with me here? Why would I be joking with such a thing? I'll marry you, Shola. <laughs> I, I, I thought, I thought, I, 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 I'm so excited. You have no idea. <laughs> I am so frustrated. Why? She said yes too fast. And the way she even said yes. What responsibility says yes, I do on the spot. I expected her to think about it. That girl is not serious about my proposal, I'm telling you. Wait, wait, wait. How did she say yes? When I proposed to Ngozi, she looked at me straight in the eyes. She said, Shola, I will marry you. There was instant chemistry. But Sophia, Sophia wasn't even looking at my face. What responsible lady says yes I do with chicken in the mouth? <laughs> wait, wait. Is it the chicken that is the problem now? It's not the chicken. Oh, forget it. Don't worry. Don't worry. No, don't worry. Don't worry. It's okay. You are the greatest clown that I have seen so far. It's not funny. Did you consider all this before you proposed? See, I don't, I don't, even, I don't even know what I want again. I'm just confused. I'm telling you. But wait. Why didn't you tell me before you proposed to her? Why would I tell you before proposing to her? What are you? Are you my pastor? This is a personal matter and it must be handled discreetly and carefully. Oh, really? Look, this Sophia girl is a member of my church. And she's even an usher. I know her very, very well. I mean, you should have told me before you even, before you even said anything. I don't discuss personal matters with friends. Mm. Yes. But you told me when you wanted to take the shot on Gozi, right? Forget Gozi now. What's the deal? Forget Gozi now. Ah. See, guy, as I was shooting the proposal at Sophia, she was just, she was just catching it. <laughs> That's because she's an experienced goalkeeper. What are you talking about? Look, Shala, let's take this soccer scenario. Hmm? In a penalty shootout, you have two players from the same team play the ball to the left and keep scoring now tell me if i was the third and you the keeper where would you move why are you asking guys stupid questions wait now answer me answer me now okay to the left you see that's why she caught your ball <laughs> come again you don't understand. She's divorced. What? Twice. Ila. What? what, what? Ila. I, I, I don't understand. What part of this don't you understand? Is it the divorce part or the twice part? So you said, so that's what I did, and the, um, the, the, the divorce thing, I, I just, I'm so okay, clear. Okay, 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 look, look. She has been to the altar twice. And if she marries you, you will be number three. What? 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 <laughs> just pull down, okay? I'll get you water. What? What? You see, all this is immaterial. Look, you have prayed, you have fasted. And if God says yes, nobody can. No, say. no, no. Oh. Look, look, look. 
Take some, take some, take some, take some, take some. It was terrible. I stormed into the house and I gave her the insult of a lifetime. <laughs> That's my guy. Seriously. <laughs> it was terrible. Please, please, just tell me about it. Tell me about it. You hid this from me. Sophia. And yet you've opened out your dirty mouth to tell me you love me. How can you be married twice? Twice! And I don't know anything about it. Do you know it feels to judge an outsider? Do you know? I cannot live with the deceiver. As a matter of fact, I'm done with this relationship. It is over. What did you just say? You heard me. It is over. No, Shola. My first lover cheated on me. The second one beat me and maltreated me. Now the third doesn't even believe in me. Oh, God. What is wrong with me? Am I cursed? <laughs> She was crying and begging me to forgive her. But I pushed her to the wall and I told her not to touch me. <laughs> That's my don't, guy. Don't, don't touch me. That, 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 that was how I told her. <laughs> <laughs> That's the spirit, bro. At a point, I said, come here, come, come, come. I'm not moved by your tears. Irrationally harsh to, to jump into conclusion. Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Point blank, guys. Point blank. That's how I said it. Sophia. But I said I'm sorry. What else again do you want to hear? I said I'm sorry. Get out of my house! Baby, come on. Don't baby me! You disgust me! I thought you said you were convinced to marry me. Oh, I disgust you. Yes! I disgust you! Sophia! I'm not the prostitute married twice, remember? All along, all along, I thought you, I thought, I thought, I thought you were clean. I didn't know you were a leftover. And now you're telling me I disgust you. Sorry, that, 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 that didn't come out right. I, I, I wasn't supposed to say that. That, that, that didn't come out right. Sorry. Leave me alone! I know your type. You have no integrity. You have no shame. I thought I'd at last found a God-fearing man. But now I know that you're only moved by greed and lust. Sophia, why are you talking like this? Shola, get out of my house. Then she even let down and said, Shola, I'm sorry. Shola, I'm sorry. Sophia, what do you want me to do? Okay, I'm sorry. Look, I'm sorry. I'm begging you now and tell me I'm sorry. At a point, she even held my hand and said, Shola, come. Let's talk about it. I'm sorry. Just, we can talk about this, okay? Don't want to of your house. I said, Sophia, look, there is nothing to talk about. As far as this matter is concerned, I am done. After which, I walked out of our house. You're walking out of your Get house? Out of my house. Wait, Get out of my house! Get out of my house! Get out of my house! Get outside, just push someone. Get out of my house! Get out of my house. And I slammed the door. <laughs> that's my guy. That's Thanks, my guys. guy. Thanks. Thanks. That's my guy. You know what? You know what? This is the very first time that I will see you standing as a man. Yeah. Some ladies just think they can eat their cake and have it. They can't. <laughs> I'm proud of you, man. There is need for us to put them where they belong. Let them understand that we are not dollars. We are not. We are not. You are right. You are right. <laughs> Hello? Yeah. Next boy! Mr. Wilson. Oh. <laughs> good to see you, bro. So good to see you. <laughs> How are you? I'm good, I'm good, man. 
Please sit down. All Please right. sit. Thanks. So I said, go. Uh, I'm good. I'm good. I'm sorry. I hope I'm not interrupting any serious conversation. No, 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 no. Please, just be comfortable. Just be comfortable. Let me introduce you to my, my friends. Um, meet Alfred, Mr. Alfred. Hi. And this is Mr. Shalai here. How are you doing? So, how is everything? Do you know him? This is the son of the CEO, the next boss. Are you serious? Is yes. it Daniel? Eh? The boss's son? Yes. <laughs> I am very pleased to be sitting next to you. We only see you, we only see your pictures around. I didn't know that um, I will have the opportunity of meeting you. We went to the same secondary school, even university. But wait, 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 wait. There is news around that um, the boss will be retiring next year and he will be handing over to his son that just came from the UK. Is that you? <laughs> no, that's right, that's right, that's right. I didn't take you serious, though. Ah, Shola, did you take this guy serious? <laughs> yeah. No, I did. What, what are we talking about? <laughs> Anyways, you're um, welcome. Excuse me. Yeah, hello? Yeah. They just give me a couple of minutes, so I'll be right back. All right. Good to see you. Good to see you. Sorry, Ngozi. Oh, you know her? <laughs> uh, we, we know her very, very well. <laughs> That's my fiance. She said yes to me last month. We'll be getting married in a couple of months now. <laughs> Daniel, you seem to be um, um, in a rush. Uh, no time, bro. <laughs> no time. But how how did you guys meet? Well, you know, she's a school teacher. A friend introduced us a couple of months ago when I first came from UK. You know, she was so strict. She wasn't giving me any attention. But the moment I saw her, I just knew she was the one. Mm. And I didn't waste any time in making my attentions known. Yeah. She's a... She's an emblem of a strong and virtuous woman. You know, all her life she suffered from constant epilepsy. And because of this ailment, her former fiance opted out of a seven-month relationship. Can you imagine? <laughs> we can we imagine. imagine. You know, I really desire to meet this foolish man so that I can thank him very well for giving me the privilege of finding a priceless gold like my Hingozi. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, Danny, what about uh, epilepsy? Oh, that, we fought it through, yeah. She is completely free. But how? Well, through patience, Prayers and um, faith in God's word. <laughs> what? What? Are you all right? What? Wait, wait, water. wait, 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 I'll water. get you water. Yeah, I'll get you water. water. Please, please. Water. Is he all right? Just, just, water, water, water. I didn't trust you enough, Lord. I depend on the counsel and the wisdom of my friends. I could have lost her. I've lost your perfect will for my life, Ngozi. God, you want me. Lord, you want me. He said, then if my eyes were single, then I would walk in light. God, I've been walking in darkness for so long.
<laughs> Shola, what's your problem? Why are you taking this hard on yourself? This girl has moved on. You should also move on. There's need for you to understand this fact. There are many fishes in the river. All you need to do is train your hook and catch as many as you want. <laughs> you know, only that you need to find the right river. Exactly. And <laughs> if you have a problem looking forward, uh, we can also help you look for a good river. Oh, of <laughs> 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 When a blind man is guided and led by two blind men, <laughs> they all will fall into that same river. Do you know the difference between those that choose right and those that choose wrong? It is hearing God's voice. That still, small voice. I heard his voice. But I listen to your voices. We great, Shola. What is your problem? What is it? Do you remember what Daniel called me? He called me a fool. And yes, I was a fool. I was a fool because I followed your voices. I was a fool because I walked according to my wisdom and understanding. I was a fool because I did not walk in faith, but I walked by sight. Mm, see, we are here trying to help you. Is this what you'll be telling us? Help. <laughs> Try to help me. No, 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 no. Don't help me, guys. Help yourselves. Wilson, your home is shattered. Find Jesus and you'll find your home. Alfred, see you are the chief usher of your church. You work for God, but you don't work with God. No, you guys should just get your priorities right. It's Wilson. I know it's Wilson. What do you want? I want us to start again. Sorry? Nikki, we have both messed up. That's the truth. Um, a divorce is not the solution. Who messed up? Then who can clean up the mess? You know, Jesus can clean our mess. Jesus. I'm, I'm sorry, I don't see us coming back together. Oh, why? Were you not a Christian when you took a prostitute to the hotel? I was a church goer. I know, I know. I was not a Christian. I burnt down your house, don't you get it? We both burnt down our home to the ground. You know, we can build our home again. Jesus can help us to build our home again. Not on the sand that it used to be, but this time on Jesus the solid rock.
What's the problem with the car? Ngozi. Shola. Okay, let me help you out. Maybe she needs a little push. As usual. Yeah, as usual. <laughs> So let's do it. Thank you so much for the for the car. Unfortunately, I won't be going with you in your car. <laughs> I I understand. I wish you all the best, Shala. I wish you all the best, Ngozi. All the best. Bye. I don't know who I am. But I know who I should be. All my life I have tried. I've really tried.
Checking the alive gone. 